The HB Project and the HB Channel are supported by Hi-Fi Clubben. That sound kills good music. MQA was fiercely attacked for what it is, or at least for what some think it is. In the meantime I get more and more listening hours on the clock, so time for an update. The comments are partly political or monetary driven and partly technical. The political side I find not interesting. If people don't want to pay inventors for their inventions, why should people pay for brands instead of buying inferior copies like a Xinguan LP12 turntable? On the technical side a lot is published and I am still studying the more complicated publications. For the simple publication it is clear. They are not aware what re the research in auditory perception has brought us. So for now I will only comment on further listening tests I have done. Initially I had only a limited number of tracks and only one DAC, the Meridian Explorer 2. Although that is a fine deck for the money, it's hard to judge a coding system if you only have one decoder. Luckily the Dutch Meridian distributor lent me a Meridian Ultra deck for a fortnight and now my set 1 is permanently equipped with the MyTech Brooklyn. On the software side some albums I was given, like that by Eddie Nunning. Some albums I bought and Tidal now streaming MQA made the collection big enough to do the test I had set out to do. Play only MQA tracks for a week and then switch back to normal PCM. Well, I am now under the impression that MQA sounds less stressed, projects a more natural and open stereo image and does wonders to the voice or actually does nothing to the voice in contrast to normal PCM. On 2L.no you can download a number of classical tracks in about any resolution and all versions are produced from the same DXD master. One of those tracks, the Et Misericordia from Arneson's Magnificat 4, is available for free from 16 bit 44.1 kHz to DXD, which is 24 bit 352.8 kHz, and DSD64 to DSD256. When started at 1644, the soprano right in the beginning sounds somewhat harsh, as I often hear. That gets less when ch choosing higher sampling rates, but only the MQA file at 352.8 kHz sounds close to natural. Riders on the storm by the doors starts with rain and an ex-colleague appropriately said that you can count the raindrops in MQA as where well it's more of a kind of noise in PCM. David Bowie's Space Oddity is another good example where the voice is so much more natural, dare I say analogue. But all these details are not what I really like about MQA. The sound has the good aspects of analogue without losing the benefits of digital. It seems to be the best of both worlds. Another phenomenon which I can't explain but does happen is a lower interference of the room acoustics. It is something I noticed when an amp has better control over the speakers, but it seems to be a byproduct of MQA as well. Is it because less time smearing makes the tone shorter to the right length? Beyoncé's Lemonade, which is quite bass heavy, sounded cleaner in the deep lows than the non-MQA version. Well, time has taught me to be careful. Before I definitely decide, I first want to study the well argumented criticisms. And not all MQA recordings are fully convincing, at least not on my equipment, another factor I must take into account. Having said that, I find myself checking what MQA music has become available every morning, for it surely tastes for more. I still have some equipment to review before I can spend time on the criticisms, so bear with me. Subscribe to this channel, my newsletter, my Facebook, Twitter or Google Plus and you'll be notified when the follow up appears. 
If you have a question, post it below this video, but please don't ask me for buying advice. See my about questions video to find out why. If you like this video, please consider supporting the channel through Patreon. See the link in the show notes. And don't forget your to tell your friends on the web about it. I am Hans Beekhuizen, thank you for watching and see you in the next show or on the HBproject.com. And whatever you do, enjoy the music. <laughs>